One of the best like fried chicken and waffles I've, I've tasted in a long time, man. This is great. I want you to get the crust. That's not maple syrup, that's like caramel. That's delicious. That flavor is great. You get like a spicy fried chicken, like a nice waffle, so call it stuff up in, and make it look really kind of sick with a like crispy soup potato hay. You got a nice dish. Yep. Fort Myers finest, man. Delicious. Super happy. Mmm. Bam. Donuts to set. We're gonna go wrestle alligators today. <laughs> You'll need the energy comes with the donut. That's right. So this is the world famous Bennett Fresh Roast Donut Shop. Right? It is, it is. It's world famous because we make everything from scratch. Everything is rich and doughy and puffy and wonderful. I love it. So so these are these are yeast donuts, these aren't cake donuts, right? Anybody can make a cake donut. Not right. everybody can make a yeast donut. It takes two hours to make each of these donuts. Our most popular donut, though, is the glaze. Everybody loves the classic. Exactly. Right? Mm. Look at that, man. Hero status. There you go, my friend. You're going to make a lot of people happy today. Thank you. Appreciate it, man. Told you they were good, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> so it's good, right? Very good. Hey, so here we are at Gator Rama, just outside of Fort Myers, Florida. We're ready to kick off the Extra Mile and the Great Food Truck Race. We're going to go wrestle some alligators today. And then we're gonna go check out Fort Myers to see what's cooking. All right, guys, you want to tell Sarah that alligators are vegetables? Are we live now? We've been live. <laughs> can you can you hear my silent screams? And they're all looking at me, man. Look at that. They're all looking at me. What are you looking at? There's only five teams left in our summer beach battle right now, man. Maybe 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 there'll be four today. Nice shot. Fantastic. All right, that was great. So we just wrapped out of the first scene here in Fort Myers for the Great Food Truck Race. Now, Patty, the owner of this place, is going to cook up some alligator for us. Uh, let's see what that tastes like, man. I bet it's going to have a little bite to it. Is this it? I'm in the right door. Come on in. You guys live on the alligator pond. Well, where would you expect us to live? Fantastic, man. Listen, thank you so much for hosting us today. You're going to make for us a original alligator dish, right? It is, a fancy one. All right, so we're gonna make hashtag the fancy alligator dish, right? I think so. All right, so tell me about it. You're gonna get the best tail you've ever had. I, I Listen, I'm, I'm looking for good tail. And um, Alan, what are you cooking up over there, man? Oh, yeah. Gator ribs here. So these are gator ribs. This is Alan's specialty. Oh, I, so so these are crispy fried alligator ribs? Yes. Mm, aren't, really those, good. aren't those surprising? They're really good. <laughs> Can I help you? Can do sure. This? Tell me about what you're chopping up. So I am topping up, up some cilantro, garlic, uh -huh. and some good wine. Oh, that's so much better than what I was doing. So we okay. use the top tail and the bottom tail. Okay. Those are the prime best mm -hmm. cuts. Yes. I put it in a marinade mm -hmm. of lime juice and garlic and let it sit for at least an hour. Almost like a ceviche kind of cure on top of it, that's right? That's a fancy word. So we're going to take these guys, and, and, and they have a nice coat on the outside, mm -hmm. right? Because you want a good crust? Well, in a perfect world. Well, that, those are the only worlds we live in. We're, <laughs> we're on an alligator farm in Florida <laughs> making gator bites. It's pretty perfect. <laughs> let's get cooking. Okay, let's do it. All right. All right. So we got some pasta here. This is like some good corkscrew pasta, mm -hmm. right? And then we're just going to take some of our fancy gator bites. Fancy, fancy. It's placed so nicely. <laughs> we are in the city, folks. Is this a fancy gator dish or what? It's really, really bright. And like the acidity from the lime juice totally comes through. I think that is a juicy bite of Southwest Florida, baby. To me, this is like chicken piccata. It's like veal piccata. Mm -hmm. This That's place right. is fantastic. We had so much fun with you today. Ah, right, we enjoy you. it. Thank I appreciate you. it. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is so good. Mm -hmm. What's up, guys? How you doing? How are you? Oh, look at the crowd today. Oh, my God. <laughs> so these guys are hustling right now. We found a fantastic location. This is a, a my, kind of a microbrew setup here in Fort Myers, man. How you guys doing? You guys having a good time? Yeah. I think this looks pretty great. So this is Dixie Fish, and I think it's one of the best kept secrets in Fort Myers, Florida. It's right on Fisherman's Wharf. Take a look at this whole fried 
red snapper. It was just pulled out of the water. It's got to rub with like a nice chili spice on it. You can taste it. They fry the whole thing. It's got to get the head, the tail, you get everything. Oh, look at that, look at that. Old oh. fried yellowtail snapper. Come on. That's a masterpiece, man. Enjoy, Tyler. Beautiful. Thank you so much, man. I love that. It's crispy. It's delicious. I got all the fixings with it. Everybody that kind of congregates here in South Florida, they're, they're here for a reason. They're all kind of coming from someplace. There are a lot of snowbirds here. And they come out here just kind of get lost in all of it. Who wouldn't want to get lost here? This is paradise. Donuts, crazy alligators, whole fried yellowtail snapper, a beautiful sunset right here on the water. Uh, this is absolutely amazing. Thanks so much for watching. And we'll see you guys next week on the road. Hey everybody, thanks so much for watching The Extra Mile on Food Network's YouTube channel. That's a wrap here in Fort Myers, Florida. Make sure you smash that like button, turn on that bell for notifications. We'll see you next week.